so like I know nothing about his past life, which I don't know if it's healthy or not. You do, but like why are you leave a know comment about below if we <laughs> like you do you guys know about all the exes? Because I feel like I'm the only one that don't really know much, which is fine because he doesn't really ask me anything about my ex either, which is okay too. Is that healthy though? Like, should your partner know about previous relationship or not? Like, when was the last time? Bye. Felty Tins. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? Welcome back to our channel. Welcome Felty back. Felty Tins. <laughs> so today, we are going to be playing another challenge called When Was the Last Time? Mm -hmm. Where we ask each other when was the last time they did something. Yep, yeah. you enjoy. Enjoy. Let's get into it. When was the last time you cry? Because he's not a crier, but I want to know. When was the last time you cried? Like, I don't know if he has emotions. All right, let's hear my answer, but. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> my eyes are getting dry just thinking about it. Oh, wow. <laughs> this is who I married, guys. <laughs> no, the last time I cried. Even if you cry on our wedding days, you know, everyone is like, oh, if my man don't cry on my wedding day, I'm turning back. I was happy. That's happy with sad. tears. You, you, you're happy to the point where tears come down your cheek. We're going to have a redo. So hopefully he cries then when he sees me in that white dress and stuff. Because, you know, hopefully. But anyways, when was the last time <laughs> you cry? <laughs> uh, probably the couple, maybe a month or two ago. Why? I teared up a little bit for one thing, something. What? Something that happened. What happened? Mm -hmm. What happened last? Oh. Okay. Yeah. You want to talk about? Yeah. You're fine. Oh, you felt sad. And I wouldn't even know you felt sad because it was something that happened to me. And... We were going through it and Tyler was like, Tyler, he was like, hey, <laughs> but yeah, all right, that's good to know. <laughs> that I have emotions. Yeah. <laughs> all right, Trisha Nett. Right. When was the last time you lied to me? trying to think when was the last time i lied to you i told a lie when i guess in that same time and you're like aren't you okay and i'm like no i'm okay and then i'm not okay <laughs> i do that a lot like every time when he asks me are you okay i'm not okay but if i tell him if i'm not okay then he gets all you know frustrated <laughs> because i am not okay and it's just like too okay. frustrated person you know i prefer I to not tell. be okay i can tell and then you're like sitting there like i know you're not okay yeah and then you're telling me you're okay because so, like, like there's asking. not much you know i'll tell you eventually but yeah those are that's the most i can think of and he's asking me are you good but i'm not good and i'm like yeah i'm good yeah <laughs> but yeah okay. my turn when was the last time you ready for this mm -hmm. you ready for this i'm ready <laughs> when was the last time you thought about your ex. <laughs> when was the last time you talked about your ex? Whenever you bring it up and you say, you ask about it. Yeah, because it's so like, I know nothing about his past life, which I don't know if it's healthy or not. You do, but like, why do you Leave have to know about Leave a comment below if we, <laughs> like, you do you guys know, know about all the exes? 
because I feel like I'm the only one that don't really know much, which is fine because he doesn't really ask me anything about my ex either, which is okay too. Is that healthy though? Like, should your partner know about previous relationship or not? Like, I mean, you're going forward, I don't so they feel like don't we should, need to. I don't feel like if we get to the point where we compare our relationship now to like what I had with my ex. No, like you. Like we shouldn't be comparing no, it No, definitely like, not. Because what you have now is what you have now and whatever. But like, I don't know. Is it healthy? Comment below. Like, what do you think? Like, what are your thoughts about this? Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Honestly, I'm not sure. I'm still young at relationships. <laughs> but I'm not sure for real. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But yeah. Okay. But yeah, whenever you bring it up, that's the only time I think about it. So it's your fault. <laughs> okay. When was the last time I made you angry? Today. Mm. Oh like, we're God. having such a perfect day because we, get like, at my work, we get, like, five, seven um, days off. Otherwise, from the vacation days you get. And today was one of those days. Wow, and we were, like, so nice together, being happy that we are both off and we're seeing each other because we barely see each other. Which is good and bad because good, our relationship will forever stay young and new and learning each things and trying to catch up. Bad because I barely see him, which is okay. <laughs> but not so much okay because I still want to see him. We still need to get things done and it's just hard. But um today's one of those days we got to spend time with each other and we were just like catching up on stuff doing stuff making videos and stuff we were having fun and we left to go to an appointment and i'm saying to tyler tyler i can drive and you meet me there and we do all kind of stuff and he was adamant that we drove together and i'm like tyler we're going to be late but because i don't want to make him frustrated because i i, I sorry keep going I was like, okay, because if I should say anything else, he's going to get mad if I should leave him. And I'm like, we're having a good day, as I say, and I'm trying to leave it to remain a good day. It ended up that I was late and my appointment was like canceled, basically. They were like a no-show. I was a no-show, even though I was like 10 minutes late, but I was still a no-show. And yeah, my appointment got canceled because of that. And I, I don't have any more days to go because my schedule my work schedule doesn't work with their work schedule and it's like something really important where i have to go soon but i just don't have any time to go and it's just like awful <laughs> and he made me miss it just because he never listened to me and let me drive and he meet me there like nothing was wrong with that i and as I, I say, he is the one that always car. is late. See, I was I the one waiting for him. I could get you there quicker in my Yeah, car. your car is faster and everything. Until but we got stuck behind people that were driving 30 miles Which is expected. Which is expected. Not expected. It's, you it's driving the speed limit. I mean, you should drive the speed limit, but you know people drive weird here. <laughs> like, Very weird. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it's, I was out. like so angry because I missed my appointment. My question, yep. when was the last time you thought about breaking up? When was the last time you thought about breaking up? So you actually think about breaking up? <sighs> no, I really haven't thought about it. Oh, wow. <laughs> Is that's not believable though? Yeah, it can be if you want to believe it. You want to believe it? Do you see? This is the Tyler. I'm happy you guys are meeting no. Tyler. No, <laughs> this is who I'm talking no. to. <laughs> I never really thought about it. Never really. When was the last time you were mad about something someone did? Not me someone else when was the last time somebody really made you mad like I'm thinking I'm thinking 
I'm thinking, I really don't let people get to me a lot. Mm. I'll be annoyed at stuff, but to be mad, <laughs> you must have done something crazy. But I don't use my energy on people much anymore. And it's like, it's something that's affecting me. I just like speak my mind instantly, even though I shouldn't. Because it, you know. Yeah. But I, I, I do. But I don't make someone like have, make me have built up anger in me. That's not good for the wrinkles. <laughs> but yeah, I can't tell when last I've been angry at someone. When was the last time I embarrassed you? Embarrassed me. Mm -hmm. Embarrassed me? <laughs> Too many the cows. <laughs> like you said, they video, you're walking. Yeah, but bed. walking in <laughs> person. I, just, like, I think when I do stuff, he just looks at me like, here we go again. <laughs> like, why you have to do that, Trish? Like, <laughs> but he can't say that all though because I'm going to look at him like, who are you talking to? <laughs> but, <yeah. laughs> <laughs> you want me to answer that? <laughs> answer. No. <laughs> no. I'm, I'm gonna. It's gonna be boring answer again. Okay, guys. Yeah. It'll be boring. Okay. Yeah, I can't remember last time you embarrassed me. Okay. But I embarrass you a lot. No. Like you do stuff and. <laughs> It's funny, but like I don't ever feel embarrassed about it. Right. Like even when we're around a group of people or people we know or people we don't, like I don't feel embarrassed. Like I probably join in with you if you're anything. Am I fine? And they just need to give me the red nose, but I know. Huh? They just need to give me the red nose. What do you mean the red nose? Like give it my second to get it. And if you don't get it either, I don't know. Like Pinocchio, like your lying? red red nose. Pinocchio had red have red nose. Rudolph the red nosed reindeer. Correct me if I'm wrong. Clowns have red nose, right? Oh, you're calling yourself a clown? No, you're not a clown. <laughs> <laughs> don't smile like that. <laughs> <laughs> that was creepy. <laughs> So that's the last time I embarrassed you. <laughs> Our first moment together of her embarrassing me. Okay. I guess this is the end of our video. Someone is getting a little heated over here. <laughs> but I hope you guys enjoy. Yes. Yeah. And remember to like. <laughs> We and pause there for <laughs> yeah. Remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And hit that bell. Ding ding. Yay! And we'll see you guys in our next vid vid. See you guys. Felties out. When was the last time you talked bad about me to your family? <laughs> no, I think about that in my head. <laughs> <laughs> No. Never. You know what I want to know? When you decided, when we decided that we we're going to be in a relationship and you're going to like break it to your family that we're mm -hmm. together, what did you say to your family?